Hello everyone. I thought it would be interesting in this video to take a look at an unusual but lethal and useful weapon which Ukraine is operating, the Palm Mine. These were sent as part of an aid package which Germany claimed included 2,000 mines. Palm stands for Panzerhabria Riecht or anti-tank directional mine. They are off-route mines which when triggered will fire a small thin stabilised rocket different than usual anti-tank mines which are triggered and detonated under the vehicle. Now these aren't the only off-route anti-tank mines in service, for example Poland has the MPB, but this is one which we know is in use by Ukraine, so we're going to take a look at it. The mine first entered service as the Palm 1 in 1988. It is mounted on a small flexible tripod, this tripod can spin 360 degrees, elevate 90 degrees or depress 45 degrees, allowing the system to be rigged and set up in a number of different locations with a number of different firing angles. It is suitable for protective use or tactical use and is intended to disrupt the movement of enemy forces. The mine can be fired by command, pressure plate or by a trip wire. With the tripwire, it is an optical cable placed on the road. Once a heavy vehicle rolls over it, this cable then triggers the ignition of the charge. This then fires the projectile to the target. Now they don't have to strike the first vehicle in a convoy either. Palm 2 can be set to skip 9 vehicles before detonating allowing for it to target key vehicles in the centre of a convoy. For example, if a recon patrol spots an enemy convoy with a priority target being, say, a fuel truck, the lead vehicle such as a BMP-1 can pass over it, the next vehicle can, and so on, until the priority target arrives. Then, the mine detonates. This will also help it to avoid some types of anti-mine system by letting the anti-mine system go over the top before it actually detonates the fuse so it's very useful a very useful feature the palm 1 version has an effective range of 2 to 40 meters the palm 2 is upgraded with a range of 100 meters the palm 2 also has an upgraded warhead allowing for armor penetration of 750 millimeters for point of reference, the BMP-1 has armour thickness of just 33mm. The T-72 has armour thickness of around 700mm at the front of the turret and hull. The BTR-80, 10mm in the hull. So these are powerful weapons, fast too. Once triggered, they travel at 120 meters per second. They are also quite light and easily transported, weighing just 20 kilograms. So they can quickly and easily be taken to a possible ambush point. So there we have the Palm 2. I think it's quite a cool weapon and was worth having a closer look at how it works. If you enjoyed the video, I'd appreciate it if you'd click like and subscribe to my channel. Cheers and take care.